my name is Sienna Mayer Dora Muddy Stubbs and I'm a Yulunga woman from North East Arnhem Land. I've grown up here in Nidakala, which is a beautiful community along the coastline of North East Arnhem Land. My weekends have always consisted of following my mothers along the coastlines and through the mangroves to collect for our families. And this has been happening for thousands of years and it's an important source of life for, for Yulunga people. And you know, Yulunga people are always teaching through, through touching and through um, experiencing. You know, Yulunga babies, they grow up and they watch and they feel and they touch. And this is how I've learned from my mothers. When I was 12, I, I started writing a book and I was so uh, lucky, lucky enough to get it published. Um, the book is about the birds that we have here in North East Arnhem Land. There are so many coastal birds that I know about, like the Gaintjur. Gaintjur is a reef heron one of the birds that we have here along the coastlines. I just feel like with everything in Yulong culture, everything has importance and he has importance. So even at my young age, at 18 years old, I've seen a lot of changes in our environment and in this home that we have here you you notice when things start to change you notice I've noticed about the amount of salt that we have in the mangroves salinity is going up it's increasing and you know the the, the coastlines and the casuarina trees that we have here the erosion the amount of erosion that is happening like is crazy and the obvious one the rubbish that collects on our beaches here from you know from the sea it's it's like it's become a normal for our beaches to look like that you know i don't remember a time when um some of our beaches didn't have that it's it's easy to feel sad and to feel, you know, negatively about all of this. But the, a way that we can bring it around is actually to make change and to step up and demand action for the protection of our coastlines. Turning 18 this year, that means I get to vote. And I'm very, I'm so excited. I'm, I finally have a chance to have a say and to bring my voice up and that's something that I can do now. I can vote for someone that will put our coastlines first and who will think about the importance of these beautiful habitats that we have. My generation are going to have to live with the effects of the inaction that has happened all of these years.